big moment coming up for Florida will be Trinity Thomas. Kathy, we mentioned a couple of weeks ago a lower leg injury. We weren't sure she was going to compete. And all of a sudden, just before today's competition, Jenny Rowland, the head coach, says she's going on bars and probably ball. How about that development? And keep in mind that this has limited her training, too. It's not just that she wasn't able to compete at regionals. So she has to rely on her basic training that is so solid. Reigning NCAA all-around champion and champion on this event as well as floor. She has scored many tens on this event. She has really great technique, great timing, good form. Smooth. Very, very smooth. Effortless really shows up that final pass to handstand. And the double layout, and it's huge and beautiful. Oh, my. Wow, what a rock star oh. beast. <laughs> I'm telling oh you. Oh, my goodness. She hasn't done any landings in two weeks. And she drills a double layout oh. under enormous pressure. I can't there. even wow. imagine the feeling that she had first before she started the routine and then upon landing, wow. So these transitions is what Trinity Thomas does best. Just effortless swing, great amplitude, technique, and this dismount, just perfection. Oh my goodness, what a moment for the Florida Gators. Literally an hour ago, we weren't sure she was gonna go at all. This is a very emotional weekend for this graduate student. Was her career coming to an end? Well, she's still in there and so is Florida. What a clutch performance here in the first of four rotations. Semi-final one. Semi-final one, double layout, Whoa. Solid and a great land. Another one-two punch for Florida. Trinity Thomas got a nine-nine-five. 